Hello and thank you for watching. My name is Rachel Barnett with Gentle Frog. I'm here to create videos for you to help you understand QuickBooks slightly better than you currently do. If you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, please put them in the chat box. Thank you. Hi, my name is Rachel Barnett and I'm with Gentle Frog. In this video, I want to show you how to take your QuickBooks desktop file. Um, in this case, it's literally on my desktop. And instead of having it on my desktop where I'm really hoping that I don't accidentally delete it, I would rather save it inside of QBox. If you're not already familiar with QBox, um, go ahead and Google it, QBox by Coral Tree. Um, I do have information about it. I have other blogs where I kind of show you how it works. In this video, I just, I needed to move a file from my desktop to QBox and I thought, well, gosh, what if I just showed you how easy it was? So right now you can see that my file, my QuickBooks file is located on my desktop, my computer desktop. So I'm just gonna go ahead and close QuickBooks because I don't need it, that's not helping me at all. Uh, let me get my start menu to appear. It's very hard to tell. Um, when I use Mac and I use Parallels, um, my QBox icon is this little tiny speck, um, but on my Windows PC, it's much easier to tell. In any case, here I am. This is my QBox Explorer. When I want to open a file that is within QBox, I just come in here and I click on it and I open. What I really want to do is move my QuickBooks file off of my computer desktop and into QBox so that I can then open it on either of the computers that I use. So uh, let's do this. I just, for me, it's easier to go to the file folder. You'll do this however you want. I go to my file folder and I say, okay, I would like my desktop. So I just go to my desktop. You can see that I have a bunch of stuff on my desktop. My QuickBooks file is gonna be a QBW file. Um, that isn't very apparent by looking at my list, but I can see that this is the name of the file, or this is the name I have just given my QuickBooks file. It's also kind of got this kind of green icon on the left. The difference between this one and this one down here as you can see, this one's the backup. So this is the file that I restored, the file that I'll be using, the file that I can double click on and get into my QuickBooks. All I wanna do is just put it in QBox so that it will sync in QBox and be available to me there. So I'm gonna put it into the file folder called sample file. So I, I have it right here. I'm just gonna drag it and drop it. This is amazing, really, the video is only here because sometimes it's easier to watch a five second video or slightly longer than it is to read a bunch of text. But you can see right now it's syncing. It's all synced up. It's now available. I can now access my sample QuickBooks file on my Lenovo if I wanted to. So that's it. I just wanted to show you how to drag and drop and how quickly it syncs up. For you, it may not sync that quickly. I really have almost nothing in my sample file yet. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. If you need to reach out to me for any reason, you can reach us at gentlefrog.com. Thanks again. Mm -hmm.